Hey gorgeous Lois here and welcome to my channel! In today's video, uh, magkatry tayo na isa sa pinakasikat na milk tea dito sa Pilipinas at uh, tingko sa buong Asia or buong Asia, no? So, taga-Kabiti ako. So, napakahirap talaga maghanap ng milk tea na ito. Ito yung Macau Imperial Milk Tea. Imperial Milk Tea, whatever. So, maghahanap sila na opening today. Um, July 17, 10 a.m. Meron sila parang buy one, get one promo. So, hindi ko kumakahabol ako kasi mamadali ako. It's almost 10 a.m. So, I'll be coming from Cavite City and I'm going to Bacoor. So, samahan niyo ako or kung hindi mo na makapag-vlog, ay pabalikan ko kayo pag ano na ako sa area. <laughs> Hey, filled your ating milk tea kasi sobrang haba ng pilo. So, your milk tea sesh natin ay magiging sushi sesh. So, I got something from, um, what do you call this? Tokyo Tokyo. So, this is it mga gorgeous, no? So, lalafang muna ako kasi gutom na gutom na ako. As in, gutom na gutom na ako. At hindi ko yung favorite namin yung aking mother at ng aking kapatid na dragon na. So, ito yung mga gorgeous. At isa siyang malaki hipot. And I know sa mga viewers ko dyan, followers ko, aware siguro kayo na allergic ako sa shrimp. But, you know, minsan, kailangan ka maging pasaway. Kain muna ako bago ako mag-drive. Kasi ang hirap gutumin sa biyahe. Tapos after nito, uuwi na rin ako. And, dahil... Andito na rin lang naman tayo sa ating ano mukbang mukbang ang mini mukbang ako ay magsasagot ng mga inyong katanungan. If you remember last time nagpost ako sa Facebook ng mga ano nyo, mga Q&A, mga ganon. So sasagutin ko yung isa-isa at sana may time pa tayo. Hindi lang. Alam niyo ba hindi ako marunong gumamit ng chopsticks kaya bahala na si Batman at palamin ako ng fork. So, meron tayong sasagutin ng mga questions, pero subo muna tayo. Mm. Mm. So, unang tanong, from Sheen, my friend, how can betrayal doesn't come from our enemies? Enemies. Well, bakit nga ba mga gorgeous? I think the reason behind this, for, for my personal ano ha, opinion lang to ha. Um... Usually ka, kasi di ba sabi nga nila may kasabihan tayo na um, yung mga tao na mas malapit sa atin or yung akala natin close sa puso natin at hindi tayo um, i-down or uh, parang iiwan sa ere yung pa yung mga tao at the end of the day pala sila pa yung magtataksi sa iyo kasi Sa tingin ko, dahil nakita nila personally, yung buong buhay mo to the point na meron na nagiging jealousy or um, inggit. Kaya ang ending yan madalas ay yung akala mo kaibigan mo sobrang subaybay sa'yo and all. Yung pala minamatsyagan ka na. At at the end of the day, sa huli, um, sila rin na maglilit. Parang down sa'yo or sila yung maglalaglag sa'yo. So, marami sa ganyan, no? But I'm not gonna mention any names. So, bahala kayo. Matamaan kayo. Ganon. Na, akala mo bait-bait nila. Pero yung pala, they just, ano, want to take advantage of your niceness. Um, yung pagiging mabuti mong tao. I'm not saying na mabuti akong tao. Hindi naman tayo perfect. Nobody is perfect. But, yun nga. Kaya, I think that's one of the reasons why betrayal doesn't come from an, our enemies, but it comes from our close friends and minsan sa relatives pa yan. So, pero sa akin, madalas na sa kaibigan sa relatives, maraming nang problema. So, yun lang. I hope she nasagot kong tanong mo, pero medyo nosebleed yun ah. So, second is from my sis, who is one of the sikat na YouTubers now, si um, Candy Inoue. 
So, ang tanong niya sa akin ay, any advice for those people who are in a long distance relationship? I love you. I love you too, sis Candy. So, ang advice ko is, be faithful. Do not be loyal, but instead, be faithful. Because when you say loyal, no, ano yun eh, parang oo, oh, oh, at the end of the day, siya pa rin yung jowa mo, siya pa rin yung boyfriend mo, siya pa rin yung, let's say, asawa mo. But, you still have the tendency to look at other girls or other uh, boys, other guys. But when you say faithful, faithful ka. As in, doon ka lang sa girl, doon ka lang sa sa taong yun na mahal na mahal mo kahit makita kang sexy, may makita kang maganda which is just normal naman na magiging attracted tayo pero the back of our minds dapat ah, ang katwira mo lagi eh parang ako tsaka yung boyfriend ko na si Dex sa fancy ko na si Dex na yeah, she's pretty or she's he's handsome but I have I have Dex, I have Lois that's how that's how we work on our relationship so and Isa pa sa mga importante sa long distance is you update each other, you talk to each other every day. It doesn't mat matter even for, ano, it doesn't matter whether it's call or text. But sa case namin, we always make sure and he always makes sure to call me. So, misa lang nakakabis siya ng tawag sa akin kapag super tired siya from work because he's working. And we have different time frames. So, pag umaga dito, pag gabi na dun, or gabi dun. So, yun. But we always talk to each other. We send pictures. Um, lagi kasi napi kasi no kasama ko pag maalis ako. There was even at there were not was but there were times recently or lately lang na nahakatulug kami na naka video call. And then there was this one time na like nag end na lang yung call because alo ba siya. So parang almost sixteen hours kaya magkausap. And kung katrong yung ako na kasawa ako may sa isat isa no. Kasi bakit ka magsasawa? Ibig sabihin noon, pag napangasawa mo na ito, mapapangasawa mo na ito, bakit ka magkasawa? You'll see her or his face every single day. So, there's no reason for you para magsawa. Instead, dapat nga maging, mas maging masaya ka. So, ayun. Isa yung sa mga ginagawa namin. Update kami with each, uh, with, it, with each other. And, um, we always make sure na we tell each other na I love you. We say I love you to each other every now and then. But, I have to admit, I'm I'm sweeter. Alam naman friends ko yung kaisama friends ko klingi ako what more pa sa boyfriend ko. But he's also sweet, mga gorgeous mga guys and girls. So super sweet niya sa akin. I know, marami siguro. Dami ko na sinabi no. Gusto ko lang explain no. Um, ano marami na kita kaya? Oh, paro na gorgeous yung long distance, blah blah blah. We haven't been together that long, pero alam mo na kapag siya na. You, you'll, you'll just feel it. You'll know it when he's the right one. Because I used to say na feeling ko, like feeling, feeling ko siya na subo mo na ako. Ah. But, ayun, we had a feeling. I just said, siya na, he's the one. And I have been waiting for this for my entire life. Pati siya ganun din. So I'm very thankful for both very thankful and blessed na nagkakilala kami at blessed kami talaga lahat. Yun lang. So, be honest, be faithful, love one another. Um, be strong kahit ano pa maging problema nyo. Wear things out together. Huwag nyo hahayaan na kahit long distance, huwag nyo hahayaan na magkaaway kayo, matulog kayo na hindi kayo okay. Mas okay yung when you work nyo yung mga bagay-bagay together. Yun lang. Subuna tayo. Subuna tayo. Sarap. Next question. What keeps you going? From EC Hi Web. Thanks for that question. Well, sa tingin ko, Sa tingin ko, no, na what keeps me going? Maraming bagay. Ah, uh, syempre, sarili ko, <laughs> pamilya ko, si God, at ngayon yung fiancé ko, yung mga friends ko. But of course, first things first, love yourself. That's one thing that I, I've learned for the past year. So, medyo late na ako natuto, but still, I learned. So, yun easy. Uh, sino yung mga dahilan kung bakit andito pa rin ako, nage-exist pa rin ako, at ginagawa ko yung mga gusto kong gawin sa buhay ko. 
Okay, question for Michelle Quezon. Do you really think love is blind? Yes. You know what? I only saw my fiance now sa photo. Before we even started doing video calls and all. Hindi pa kami. Hindi, you know what? First time na nag video call kami. Right after na maging kami na. Yun yun. Right after maging kami. Like two days after. So, I think love is blind. Because technically, we haven't seen each other. Like, kasi parang video call kayo ka. Parang kayo nakita yun in person. Pero, the fact na hindi pa kami nakita. Just photos. Mga old photos and all. Yeah, I think love is blind. I suddenly felt this feeling na, oh my gosh, parang siya na. You know, the, the way we were talking, the way we were starting a conversation and everything. Alam mo talaga may spark na. So, I, 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 I wish that makes sense, no, Michelle? But, yeah, I believe that love is blind. So, love is blind, yes. <laughs> um, what do you do to feel positive and confident? I just try to be myself all the time. Of course, sometimes I get conscious. But, you know, I just don't mind the people these days. Parang before, kasi I used to be conscious. Nahihirapan ako ng maraming pintasera, pintasero. Parang... Like, for example, with my body, they say, Nang taba mo or plus size ka, and so, I don't care. So, sorry. So, I started being confident. Simula nung nagwa-vlog na rin ako, YouTube, you know, doing makeup and stuff. And, naging positive ako because of the positive people around me. Of course, I pray every day kay God, family ko, and of course, my future husband. So, those are the things and people who always keep me positive and confident. Sis Christina, if there's only one book you can carry or retain, what will it be? Definitely, it's the book that my uncle wrote. Um, it's uh, I'll Write You a Happy Poem. That's from my uncle, late uncle who died last year. Well, I miss him so much. Um, it's from my Lito, Tito Lito Ocampo crew. So... Available ata siya online. Hindi ko alam kung available pa siya sa bookstores. But yeah, that's the only book that I wanna keep. I have a couple of copies sa uh, habahay. So yun lang. Do you believe in life after death? I guess it's called reincarnation. I think so. Hindi ko kasi masabi. But yeah, I do believe in life after death. Sis Claudine. Bila nakikichis na sa ako, gusto ko malaman para kayo nagkakalala ng Joa Bells mo. How did my boyfriend and I meet? So, sobrang haba nito ha. Ganito kasi yon So, single ako, single siya. Merong best friend tong mama ko na si Nina Emma since kabataan pa nila or dalaga pa sila. Ngayon, dumating kasing dad ata ni Dex last year. And parang, alam ko nag-joke-joke aron sila na wala pang asawa yung anak niya. And then, itong ninang Emma ko, hindi naman ako naisip agad. And then, parang, pagod siya sa work nun ata eh. And then, after a while, na-realize niya na pakilala ako. Pero, before that, before ko nalaman, ipapakilala niya ako, na-message niya na yung dad ni Dex, si Papa Obet. Hi, Papa Obet. Hindi <laughs> ako manonood ka. Na-message niya na yung Papa ni Dex na um, Destiny! Ang hirap explain na, sorry. Um, nasaba sa, nandito yung Papa ni Dex sa Philippines for a while. And then, bumalik siya ng US. So, nasa US na siya, inad ng Ninang Emma ko sa Papa Obet sa Facebook. Ngayon, may Ninang Emma said hi to him. And all of a sudden, ang nag-reply pala si Dex. So, he was using his dad phone. I think Papa Obet asked him to reply to the message or what. And then, the next start, so, isip at ang Ninang ko, napapakalala ko si Joanne or si Lois dito. So, she showed me the photo. And then, I was kind of frustrated pa nga kasi parang ako pa yung mag-a-add. Ba't hindi siya yung mag-add sa akin? There's this app that we were using, Tango. Kasi doesn't have Facebook. It doesn't like social media, no? But I understand naman. Social media is really not good for... Not good for you know, most of the time. So, ayun. Sabi ni Dex, add, i-add daw... I-add ko daw siya sa Tango. So, ako naman si Sige. Single naman din ako. I-add ko siya. Tapos, after a day or two, nag-chaka siya nag-reply. And then, yeah, we started talking. Started talking. And, naramdam ko na may something na eh. Alam mo, yung unang pa lang, first week, second week, nag-uusap, may something na. Pero, I wasn't really that clingy, but I was really open to him. Because we're adults, so, 
he's three years older than me. And now, umuyin dag nete tong March lang, pumunta na sa bahay. But before that, siempre, siempre hard hard mo na kami ni Dex ganyan, chat chat. And then, isingi ko na rin ko pa naging kami ah. But I opened up na, yeah, I have, I had feelings for him. Ganun din pala niya, ramdaman niya na we both think alike most of the time. We both think alike ha, I think like 90% of the time. And I wouldn't forget that day na he said something about his work and then he said, I miss and love you dear. And I read it again, huh? Parang ano sinabi niya? What did he say? So, ayun, naging, after, after, few days, I asked him, are we official? And then he said, of course we're official. So, see how stupid I am? Kasi, di ba maganda na may label? Ayoko na wala label. So, after a while, after a couple of days, pumunta yung uwi yung papa niya sa Philippines. Um, pumunta sa bahay. Tagi-imus din sila. Kaya, mag medyo magkakilala. Yung, not magkakilala, but, tagi-imus din sila. And, medyo magkalapit yung house namin doon. Coincidence, everything is destined talaga na mangyari. At coincidence din. Hindi ko alam kung coincidence or destiny. Pero I think it's all destiny. So, at grabe, Claudine. Hindi ko ma- alam yun, hindi ko ma-explain. Hindi ko saan magsisimula. Pero, yes, we're getting married very soon. And salamat po sa mga sumusuporta at sa mga hindi na sumusuporta. <laughs> Dahil sa inyo naging strong pa relationship namin ng next ko. And the last question is from Davi Nuya. Da! What's one of the things that happened to you in your life that made you feel weak at para mo nalampasan? Honestly, sa work. Tsaka, yung pagkamatay ng uncle ko last year. Masin ko muna. Sobrang sakit kasi one of my uncles kapit na mama ko, parang tatay ko. And namatay elders na si Tito Boy, Tito Lito. It was really sad. But I was like taking care of him. Then, doon ako na-hospital siya. And then, sabay-sabay, pati yung... Kaya ako sinabi yung weakest part ng buhay ko yun, is mga weakest part, ay dahil may sakat ang uncle ko hanggang sa'yo namatay. May mga taong... Mga, well, I'll call them bashers. May mga bashers pa rin ako na wala malang pakundangan na maglulok sa yung tao or ano, chipping his misan ka pa rin. That's what I don't like. That's BS, sorry, but that's BS. At alam pa saan ko yun, dahil pa rin sa pamilya ko, um, naging busy ako. Sinubukan ko maging um, matibay kasi wala namang nangyari sa akin kung ako ay iyak na iyak lagi. So, yun. And yung pag-YouTube ko talaga eh, yung ginawa kong, ano ba to, Amway, para matanggal yung akin depression and, and everything na negative na naramdaman ko sa buhay ko. So, kaya thanks to YouTube, thanks to you, every, everyone who has been supportive, hindi ko na alam kung anong thank you pagawin ko sa pamilya ko, wala na akong hihiningin pa. So, yun. So, yun lang guys. Alam ko na, na, alam ko na, <laughs> dami ko sa inabi. So, so, ayan, kainin ko na yung last two. Alam nyo ba, bago mo ubus, 130 pesos yun to. Kaya mas ulit siya nakakabusog. Sana may sense yung mga sinag kong tanong. Ay, mga sagot ko sa tanong nyo. So, ay mga gorgeous. Sana, mga gawas and goals kayo ay kaya parang na-entertain dun sa mga pinag-asabi ko. Uh, Tuto ko lang magkaroon minsan ng sit-down video. Chika-chika lang tayo about life. So that's all. 
Um, kung hindi pa nakasubscribe, subscribe ko na sa channel ko. Magkakaroon ako ng mga medyo maraming videos. Nakaline up na. Gagawa na lang ako ng mga food sessions or mga mukbang sessions with friends or ako mag-isa sa bahay. And mga video video, syempre, ano pa ba? So, like, share, and again, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you on my next vlog. Bye!